My family's in town again, and every time they leave, I always get malware, viruses, and other things that show up on my computer. So this time I'm taking two steps. First, I'm making sure they bring their own laptop computers. And two, I'm setting up the DIR825 with guest zones. What that's going to allow me to do is set up two completely distinct wireless networks, one for them and one for me. That allows me to prioritize the network traffic on mine so I can stream my high def content and lock down the security on theirs so they don't get any of those nasty viruses on my network. So let me show you how to set up the DIR825 with guest zones. Let's begin setting up our guest network. And if you haven't already, please watch our other video on getting started with the DIR825. Launch an internet browser and enter in your router address. Enter in your username and password, plus any additional security characters, and click Login. Once you're logged in to the DIR825, click on Advanced, and on the left hand side, click on Guest Zone. We want to first enable the Guest Zone, and you have the option of enabling either the 2.4 GHz band or the 5 GHz band. We'll enable the 2.4 GHz band, and of course, we want to set up a WPA security access and password. Go ahead and leave the settings as they are, but be sure to enter in a pre shared key or password. This must be at least 8 letters or numbers long. Be sure to write it down to share it with your guests. Also, once your guests leave, you can always change the key or turn off the guest zone. Scroll up and click on Save Settings and allow the router to reset itself. Now if we come down to our network display, we'll see our Dealey guest network appear. I'll select it and enter in my password. That's it, we're all done. We've just created a guest network zone that separates your network and keeps it safe and secure while keeping your guests happy. Thank you and see you next time.